Hello creative friends. So this is Joy coming to you with another art journal page. So I just pulled out my 8x8 Dilusions art journal and I had this uh, paint left over from uh, the last page that I did um, in video and I decided to try to use it up on an art journal page. So I decided to put down this um, I don't know what color you call it. it's kind of a rose reddish kind of color and then I had some black so I thought oh I'll go around the edges with the black and um, just quickly like get this journal page you know painted up and at first I was just going to <clears throat> paint the journal page to use up the excess paint that I had on my um, palette but then um, I was having so much fun that I just decided to go ahead and continue um, to create this art journal page and um, go through my ephemera and my stash and find some pictures and quotes and things that you know I thought would work good on the page and just went ahead and finished the um, art journal page. So this is a real quick video. It's like you know five and a half minutes here. Um, you know, and I, when I finished this video, or the, uh, this art journal page, um, I thought, well, I probably could have done more with the background, like maybe did some stamping on the background, or some scribbling with, you know, a black pen or something, but, I mean, in the end, I like the way it turned out, so I took my Xyron, um, and I decided, usually I'll use gel medium to put down, like, pictures and images and quotes that I have in my stash but I decided to use my Xyron and just run everything through that and make them all into stickers and so here I'm had already previously before I made all these into stickers figured out you know um, the configuration of this art journal page so here I'm just peeling off um, these stickers that I made and sticking them down on this art journal page so that's what I'm doing here and I had to be really careful because, you know, a lot of these were images from magazines and the pages, uh, the paper is really thin and that the Xyron, you know, really is pretty sticky. And so I was having problems with uh, the bigger, you know, pictures actually almost tearing um, when I was trying to pull it up um, off of the backing to stick it down on the art journal page. So the quote that I uh, found in my stash to put on this page is, it's opening your eyes to opportunities, it's opening your mind to possibilities, it's opening your heart to all the joy that waits to fill it, and giving yourself permission to live your dreams. So I thought that was pretty nice. And here I'm just using a china marker to trace around the quote and then to trace around the other elements and smudge it with my fingers to give it like a shadow <clears throat> and after I went around everything and did this journal page I got to thinking that it just needed something a little extra in that bottom left hand corner so I found another little quote that says every success begins with a dream which I thought was kind of cool, and uh, another little butterfly that you'll see here in a minute that I stick in the bottom left-hand corner. And um, so, you know, this is a really quick, easy, you know, uh, art journal page. Like I said afterwards, I thought, well, I could have done some kind of stamping or scribbling or something in the background, and here I'm putting the little antennas on the butterflies and the moth there. And um, But it was fun to do, and it used up some of the paint I had left over from the previous project and so that's pretty much you know the art journal page that I created this week if you um, like this video you can hit the like button or you can hit the subscribe button if you'd like to see more or you can leave me a comment I would love to hear from you um, you can also you know ask me any questions um, I definitely will be you know answering any questions um, I love you know doing art journal and and art and sharing with, with everyone and have a lot of fun you know um, seeing what everybody else is doing so it's just you know my you know creative outlet which is always fun 
And here is that other little moth, I guess it is, and a quote that I decided to put in that lower left-hand corner, and I went around it with the china marker, and then put little antennas on the moth as well. So that's the journal page for today. Thank you for stopping by, and we'll talk to you guys later. Have a good day. Bye-bye.